If you've got a number of tracks that you want to use the same effect on, or you just want greater control over those tracks together, then a submix bus is a good option. So let's take a look at how we do that, how we insert it and do the routing. I'm in the VIP. Location, VIP window. I've got the usual project loaded, which is this. And I want to route tracks three and four through a submix bus. So let's have a listen to track three first of all. Two swell slash three vocalized motif. So three is this. Solo one. Okay. And if I go to track four. Four vocalized lid. And solo this one. Solo one. So together, this is what I'm going to route through the bus. So at the moment, I have to solo both of them. Solo off. Three vocalized motif. Solo off. Okay. But when we put them through the bus, we'll be able to solo the bus and they'll both be, you know, controlled together. Revolve the menu. Track three vocalized motif. Okay, so let's go to track four. Four vocalized lid. And press control, shift and seven. Add some mixed track below the current track. That's added our bus. Track five bus one. It's called bus one. Let's rename it. Track name, edit, bus. So it's called test bus. Enter. Five test bus. So we created our bus, simple. Control, shift and seven on the numbers row will add a submix bus below the track you're on. So you can insert one anyway, it doesn't have to be below the track you're routing. Four vocalized lid, three vocalized motif. We go to track three, tap to solo, solo off. press control, applications, control options, context menu, S, solo water plus S, S. And then when we arrow down here, we will find that bus. Solo exclusive, solo safe, global solo modes, audio devices, zero, no output, five, test bus, five, there we are, test bus, press enter. Enter, leading menus, three vocalized motif. So we've routed track three, go to track four. Four vocalized lid, solo off. We're already on the solo, press control, applications. Control options, context menu, S, solo auto plus S, S. And again, arrow down to test bus. Solo, solo, global solo, audio device, zero, five, test bus, five. And press enter. Enter, leading menus, four vocalized lid, track, four vocalized lid. Okay, so we've now got three and four routed through the test bus. So if we go to test bus, five test bus, and we solo it, solo one, and then press play, we get the two tracks that we're routing through it. Okay, unsolo it, solo off. So that's great if you want to change the volume or something. So let's uh, start it playing and just change the volume. Volume, edit zero dB, ten point zero zero, twenty point zero zero, ten point zero zero, zero point zero zero. Yeah. Escape. Five test bus. So that's where you would use a submix bus. On here, you could put an effect, um, you could automate it, etc.